First, taking the thin remnants. So as I said, they're called the loaf muscles. So the L refers to the two lumbricals. So these are the lateral two lumbricals towards the side of your thumb. Then the opponent's pollicis, which as the name suggests, opposes the thumb. So it brings the fingers um, together with the thumb. And the abductor pollicis brevis, abducts the thumb. And the flexor pollicis brevis, which flexes the thumb. Both of the um, muscles with the brevis on their name would suggest that there's also a longus. Those are muscles that are within the forearm. And all of these are innervated by the median nerve. So all of the muscles of the intrinsic part of the hand are innervated by the ulnar nerve, with the exception of these four um, groups of muscles. In terms of what they do, the lateral two lumbricals carry out flexion at the metacarpal phalangeal joint, so where your knuckles are, and it carries out extension at the interphalangeal joints, so that's both the proximal and the distal. And this picture really illustrates what they do. So if ever you get kind of confused about what the lumbricals do, just copy that.